Yo, what's up, what's up? It's your boy Abstract. Your boy Stilo. All right, you know what we do? Um, today we got something kind of cool for you. We're going to do a product review, but we're going to kind of put a twist on it. Um, where we're at right now, you can't hear. Uh, we're at my boy's house. We're having our little club groove, uh, biannual, so far, uh, yeah. barbecue, beats, you know, so we're at a lot of EDM, food, drinks, just chilling, a lot of DJs. A um, couple of things that we're going to preview today um, are headphones. Which one are they? The headphones are the American Audio HP 550s. We have the snow ones, which is all white. They also sell them in lime. They also sell them in lava. The lime is green. The lava is red ones. Yeah, basically. All right. And they're real cool, man. So what I want to do is instead of me and him just telling you, hey, they're cool, they're awesome, get them, whatever, we're going to have other DJs, regular club DJs, mobile DJs, house DJs, bedroom DJs, whatever. We're going to try them out. We're going to try to get their opinion on it. So you get kind of more of a everyday DJ kind of a thing and, and see what they think about them. Uh, also, we're going to show you the atmospheric RG LED laser. Oh, yeah. We're going to show you that one. We'll, we'll, do, we'll get into depth in that one later. We'll show it to you. And I'm also going to give you a peek of the uh, Mega Par... LED um, light, so it's pretty cool too. So um, stay well, tuned. Or what? See us at the end then. Yeah. Peace. Peace. What's up, everybody? It's your boy Abstract. All right, man. We're at this barbecue and then this little mix session we had going on. It's like, I don't know what time is it. It's like 2.30 in the morning, man. I was supposed to give these little quick reviews about the headphones. You know, what I'm going to do right now is uh, hit up my boy, Boy Lissick Ali, see what he got about him, get his point, and try to get some other DJs on here, too. Boy Lissick Ali, straight from Phoenix. This guy's, you know, we don't hang out all the time. All right, you use them. What do you normally use? He uses Sony, um, I'm horrible. Maybe okay. DD 700. So, all right. so basically, um, I didn't bring any headphones on this trip because it's vacation slash, you know, gig. Yeah. And um, I had the opportunity to use uh, these American Audio. Those are the those are the five HP five fifty. HP five fifties. So basically, um, with any new headphone that you normally don't use, just uh, wearing it, uh, it takes a little bit of getting used to. But I mean, I adapted pretty quick, you know, to it as far as the feel. Sound wise, I mean, it it served its purpose. I didn't have to. Uh, max it out and you know couldn't hear anything yeah and actually I had acceptable levels in my opinion and I was able to hear it cool so, cool so, you know especially when you, you don't have headphones right now yeah well exactly like what, what I want to you know put out to people look dude we're not saying they're the best we're not saying go out and get their $50 headphones right and I was actually when I used them I was like you know what I was like what you said ah eh. I wish they were a little more comfortable, but then again, they're new. So, like, all right, they'll probably take a little bit to break in. I was surprised. What I'm looking for more than anything is the sound. Sound. And it sounded cool. And so I was like, you know what, for exactly. 50 bucks, I'm, I, I'm cool with the sound. It serves its purpose. And yeah. especially if you're transitioning, once you, if you're on a budget in this economy, if you're just starting out, you know, this is something that can get you by. You know, especially if, you know, you don't have a lot of money. Well, yeah, I know people who buy, you know, expensive headphones and they break, you know, they break also. So it's like, right. you know, just take care of it and you're good. Exactly. All right. Thanks, man. Not a problem. Put you on YouTube. <laughs> Campus ready, prepare to fly. All right, man. I got my boy DJ Iso here. Plays uh, also hard house DJ. Also produces his own his own music. So check him out. Also look it up. DJ Iso. That's spelled E S E A L. Um, what kind of headphones do you normally you know use and stuff? American Audio. Making our, oh yeah, you, that's right. That's right. He has the old, the all, the all black ones, right? Yeah. All right. So this time I sh I showed up and I was like, dude, American Audio. He's like, what? All white? And I go, yep, all white. They're making what else? Let me see. They, those they, those coming all white. They come in green. They come in red. Um, all right. How they feel, comfort wise? They're on your good. Head? Good for the bass. You could hear it. You could hear everything clean when you're mixing. All right. Cool. I would recommend this to anybody if you're mixing professional DJ. Let's say. Fifty dollars. What do you think about the value? Is it worth? You know, it's like, good. It's worth it. You getting a bang yep. for your buck? You know what I'm saying? Yep. I have paid like seventy-five dollars for these, but I mean, don't what? Someone jack. Hey, whoever you are out there, what? That's wrong. Give me this. Center, give me right twenty-five right. bucks back. But anyways, all right. So what do you think? You like him? Cool. Fifty yeah, bucks worth it? Yep. I would buy him. I buy two of them. Hey, take it easy, baller. <laughs> <laughs> all right, man. Thanks. Alright, 
got my boy Splatterhouse. Fit up, Hard House DJ from Virginia. We're here in SoCal. It's a great thing that he showed up and hooked us up. He used these also. Normally, what do you use? Uh, I use the uh, Beats by Dre earbuds. Oh man, this guy's name dropping. and <laughs> He even has a Mac, guys, just so you know. All right, so you use uh, the HP 550s or by American Audio. They're, I always tell people, that, you know what, they're, that, they're for that DJ on the budget getting in. You know, some people can't get $200 headphones or, or earbuds or what, but for 50 bucks, um, what do you think about them? What's your opinion about them? Yeah, for 50 bucks, they're pretty, uh, pretty sturdy. Uh -huh. You know, they, they fit comfortably on the head, like I can barely feel them on there. Oh, cool. Wasn't, there's no, like, no distraction. Uh, you can turn them up pretty loud without distortion. Yeah, that, that's what I was surprised on too, because like I tell people, like, what, my biggest thing, doesn't matter what you pay, is how does it sound, you know. And we had a bunch, we had a, you know, it's pretty loud where we're mixing that right now. And I was like, all right, cool, I turned it up, it sounds decent. So it was cool. Yeah, what is it, thumbs up, thumbs down, what do you say? Yeah. All right, guys. Now I got my boy. I am uh, Art from Palmdale, California. Palmdale, with, like the other two thousand people who live there. But uh, um, my boy, he's a DJ also. All right, what do you normally use? Uh, normally, I use uh, Skull Candy. Oh, hey, don't ever say that out loud. Okay, I might have to edit that part out, but whatever, we'll leave it in. All right. So, what do you think about about these? Hey, you always be serious. I thought like only teenage girls bought school candy. No, I, I, I rock them out and give a shit. They look cool. <laughs> okay, okay, go ahead. Alright, so um, um, the headphones, I, I like them. The fact that, you know, they carry all like the major features as uh, as the bigger bigger brands, uh, the more expensive. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Okay, major features like what? Uh, okay, here's one of my, one of my pet peeves. Okay. It's a detachable cord. It doesn't have one. Right. I mean that's just me though. I'm real picky but like that. I actually that. don't like the detachable cord because I mean I move I move around a lot and I actually pull out the detachable cords a lot on some of my headphones. So okay, well, I don't prefer detachable headphones. All right, all right. Uh, but I do like how they uh, you know flip in 360. Okay. Get around. Um, one of the major features. <laughs> and one of the major features, like, you know, I, I break a lot of headphones and something like this. Can, all right. You know, they can fit in a little bag or something. That's like why that. you shouldn't that's buy cool. a school candy. It's cool. <laughs> But, you know, I mean, if you're talking about a headphone that's, you know, compared for the price, like, you know, $50, $60 for these headphones, you know, I, I have spent, you know, $100 on a pair of headphones that are the same as, you know, something similar to this. And they, they tend to go out, you know, when I hit a lot of you know, hard bass, uh, I play a lot of hard music and they really can't take it as far as the price. But, you know, these do, these do great, you know, they're big oversized ears, uh, you know, the ear pads. So, uh, you know, they let me monitor very well and... Like I said, you know, for the, for the dollar, for the DJ like me that likes to, you know, doesn't have a lot of money, likes to spend his cash wisely, definitely. I'd go with these, uh, you know, the American Audio headphones. Cool. Thanks, man. Peace. All right, everybody. Got my boy here, 2H, a uh, hard house DJ, hard house producer. Um, so, you know, he uses headphones and stuff like that probably more than, than I would, you know what I'm saying? Uh, all right, man. Today, you know, what do you normally use for headphones? Normally, I use the Pioneer H. Oh, whoa, whoa, hey, come on. But, uh, Get off, name dropping there too, you and Splatterhouse, okay. <laughs> no, these ones, I, I like these ones for the price. Okay. I spent hundreds of dollars on so many headphones, and these, I compare these to $100 headphones because it's, it's like the same quality. You, you get the same sound, the, the same results. And just a cheaper price. And the thing I like about these... I mean, I, okay, real quick. I don't want to cut you off. But I remember, like, when I would have spent, like, 50 bucks. I mean, when I was a younger DJ and I was coming up. I'd go, like, the Best Buy or Circuit City. And, and you spend 50 bucks on some Sonys or something. And I hated the sound on them. So, my, my biggest thing is, I don't care. Look, it's... Even $200 headphones break. You know what I'm saying? You know, there's, they're making them better now. Some of them, because they're making that... The, this part right here, they're making them... Instead of plastic, they're making them... You know, like, metal. Yeah. But... For me, my, my most important thing is sound. How did they, you know? Well, like I said, uh, these, they, I, I like them because I, I can get $50 headphones, a different brand, blow them out, and that's more money I have to spend. These ones, I, I like how they sound. They, there's no distortion, and it's a good quality headphone for the price. Now, one thing I forgot to mention to the other guys is these come in white, they come snow, and they come in green, it says slime and red lava. Cool thing to have different colors, or just you're cool with the OG black ones? No, 
I prefer black. Black or white is cool. All right. I like the white. I'm not, you know, I just, I picked them out because they're like, you know, what's up with them? I like the white. Just, just try something different. I got my other headphones and they're basic colors like everybody else, but I like that you get some, you know, you got dudes who like to match their clothes and their outfits, so, you know. <laughs> so, all right. Thanks for your info. DJ2H, producer, check them out. Hard House Music, look them up. Peace. Yo, yo, it's my boy, DJ uh -huh. Chaos. Uh, from, uh, where you at now? San Bernardino? Raylan slash San Bernardino. Okay. All right, I'm from the IE. Another DJ plays, uh, what do you normally play like? Well, I play jump, hardcore, and I like to dabble in some progressive. All right, cool. So a little bit of everything. Yeah. Um, what do you normally use for headphones? Well, right now I use uh, the Denon HP 1000s. All right. You know, I like uh, the features on that. But compared to this, uh, as far as sound quality, um, you can't tell the difference. It sounds just as clear and clean. I can hear the high pitch, the lows, the bass, everything that comes with it. But what's cool about these, uh, as you can see, if you can zoom in. This is my zoom, I have to get closer. <laughs> <laughs> the uh, audio, American audio is stitched. As far as others, it's like imprinted, you know? Like screen so, printed on, yeah. I think that's a cool little feature on here. Not everybody does that, so. How do they feel? Uh, when you get them out the box, it's gonna feel kind of stiff, but after a while, after you break them in like any other thing, it comfortable so I think I broke in they were used by a bunch of a few different DJs there. Yeah, it's nice. <laughs> okay, so yeah. fifty dollar values are what you know, what do you think? You getting your money's worth? Yeah, I mean most definitely. I mean you can't go wrong with uh, American audio. I mean they're known for some things like lights and stuff and so That's American DJ. That's like my bad. same thing though. Same yeah, basically <laughs> no nah, same company. You you're on the right track. You're on the right track. Same same company. You just you know this is American audio is more like their you know, MIDI controllers yeah. and their speakers and their headphones. Yeah. ADJ is strictly lights. So anyways, he, he tried to throw them all in there. All right. Yeah. What you think? Good? Cool? I give him a thumbs up. Okay, I approved, man. Yo, thanks for your time, man. Thank you. Peace.